Uh, yeah, obviously not the result we wanted um, or needed. Obviously, three points was would have been better. Um, but I knew it was going to be tough today. I knew they'd come and they'd give it a go, which they did. And um, I think today the word, especially first half, to describe the performance would be flat, uh, a bit lethargic. Um, and I think they just was a bit more up for the game. It felt like in, in the first half, especially. Uh, and then obviously they. We get the goal from a deflected hand ball, but um, regardless, it's we we invite that on with with the tempo we were playing at, and um, you know, if we play like that, then teams will come and punish us, regardless of where they are in the league. Uh, we get punished. 
Of course, uh, you talk about that slow turnaround, and of course, we had the game of the weekend against Leeston. It was a quick turnaround in the game. Do you feel that perhaps affected the team how they start the game today? A bit slow. No, I don't. I, you know, it's not looking for excuses for anyone. Um, I think it's just you've, you've got to, as a player, psych yourself up and get up for games, regardless. You know, my legs weren't exactly feeling particularly great, um, but as a player, you've got to go somewhere in your head and, and get yourself up for games, regardless of the atmosphere in the ground and you know how many people are there and what kind of game it is. You've got to get yourself ready in your head and, and be up for it. And today, I think that a few were just not quite there mentally which then led to us obviously going behind in the first half and then it doesn't matter who you're playing, you're going to struggle. Of course, uh, looking now towards the future, six games left in the season, Tom's back at the weekend. How vital will his role be with his experience and leadership on that pitch going into this running? Of course, look, we've, we've missed Tom, we've missed obviously Jack, you know. Um, um, obviously, it's not ideal, but... We can't look, I'm not one to give excuses and look for excuses. Um, brought some new lads in and Saturday uh, they did really well. It's you know a tough game to go to Leeson and especially conceding after 30 seconds. And then going 2-0 down in the first half, uh, made a right good go, got back into it. But I mean, people say, oh, you were unlucky, but it's not really luck. It's, you know, when you're up there and you're, you're a team that's winning things, those little things don't happen or they happen a lot less often. Of course, uh, we saw Jack come off the bench today, got the goal. What did, what was said to him to come on and get that? Was that just go and play his strengths or was it something tactical that you said to him to go on that wing and go forward and sort of press on him? Well, if anything, he was playing a bit too deep at times. He was playing for right back, but um, you know, obviously we know Jack brings, he comes on, he's lively, he's got pace. Uh, and he always affects the game when he, when he does come on. And you know, he's been, he's been doing really well when we started. Um, it was just a case of sometimes bringing that, obviously Tristan's come in, it was that physicality up top. Uh, I mean, Tristan struggled a little bit today, but he, has, he hasn't been playing that much. Uh, I thought he'd done really well Saturday, give us that vocal point we, we could play off. But I think today, just the wind and the conditions, it was tough first half. And when it is like that, you've got to roll your sleeves up and just, just be up for a good battle and make the decisions, turn them around and play forward. And I just don't think we we did that well enough. And then even myself, at times, you know, when you want to clip it down the line, I've, I've shanked it and stuff like that. And it just adds to the the scruffiness of the game and you know but it's going to happen there's going to be games like especially this time of the season when the pitches are very lively and, and uh, the conditions are tough it, it's more of a battle than a you know a game of football you know you have to put the put the football in when you can on the transitions when you win it back and move it quickly and it, it's not easy it's, it's difficult and uh, I think today it was just a case of they were a little bit more up for it than we were and of course you talk about Tristan, those new signings, they look to have settled, how impressed have you been with them since they've come into the club? Well obviously Tristan played Saturday, came in, you know, Tristan has been around this level for a long time, his experience, I think, adding that, just not just the way he plays but talking to the lads around him and uh, being that, um, giving that influence is good. Uh, and obviously a couple of young lads who came, Mikhail is a young lad and obviously Daryl um, and Demi as well have all come in, I mean you forget Saturday we've gave four players debuts, uh, three of them being 19 and 18 years old. So it's a tough ask and, um, you know, it, it is what it is. We've got six tough games to go, and, but this is what it's all about. You know, ideally we could have won today. Ideally we'd, we'd like to have beaten Stratford the other week and we'd have been a bit uh, bit more comfortable in terms of where we are. But this is this is um, what it's all about, you know, handling the pressure. And we'll see, what, you know, what, the, what lads can stand up and be counted when it counts. Brilliant. Cheers, Mac. A good look for the final six games. No worries, cheers.